Ohio Northern University, the pharmacy department, they got quite the gift. And joining us today to tell us more, we have the Ohio Northern University Dean of Pharmacy, Steve Martin. And thanks for joining us today. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Okay, it's the end of the holiday season, but you guys got quite the gift. Tell us more about it. We did. We have a wonderful alumnus who's out on the West Coast, but originally from Pennsylvania, been deeply involved in pediatric oncology for his entire practice career. And um, he has worked with us to be able to create um, a fund that will help to really launch I think careers for our students is in the sciences. And, that, and that's a very broad term, but I think that's what uh, Michael Cox really wanted to do was to create something that would really be broad based, but help to launch careers in the sciences. So this, it's a, a million dollar gift. So what kind of things will this be happening on campus or will this allow students to travel somewhere and get something? What do you think? How is it gonna, going to be used? How it will help students? Well, it, again, we've got the opportunity to use it in lots of different ways. We envision it supporting student-based research, uh, both here on our campus, but also for uh, uh, the opportunity for students to travel to do potentially you know, summer internships at uh, prestigious research institutes, uh, to spend time maybe at the NIH or at other institutions along that line. Um, it'll also help to um, to fend, uh, fund opportunities for students who are involved in um, in our PharmD program in clinical training, uh, it, again at uh, hopefully at places like NIH or CDC or other you know cutting edge uh, cutting edge facilities, it'll help to fund uh, research involved with our faculty and students together, and so there's a, there's a lot of broad opportunities for us to use these funds to help really promote students is to seek directions for their careers that are going to have. I think uh, a much more scientific focus uh, a, a, as opposed to potentially some of the clinical focus that we see in most of our graduates. Um, I think with the pandemic and the research and things that have gone into like, you know, the vaccine and stuff that this research area might be a, a great key and, and something, you know, that Ohio Northern can recruit more students and, and you can really be involved in some really cutting edge things. It, it is really cool. And this fall, we will have a new undergraduate degree in pharmaceutical and biomedical sciences that is focused exactly on that, at, at launching careers for students in the pharmaceutical and biotech, biomedical industries. And so th these funds are just, uh, it's great timing for us to be able to use these funds to help those two students who are coming to us to find career paths that will uh, you know, hopefully um, help us all in the future as we come across pandemics or other issues. You know, having folks like Michael Cox who are out there uh, finding cures for pediatric uh, cancers that no one else has found before, uh, that's the kind of thing we want to do here at Ohio Northern. Yeah, um, Dr. Cox obviously, you know, loves Ohio Northern, but like, does he want some of those students to like maybe come with him too? I mean, is this, this money donated help with uh, cancer research with children too? Well, he certainly has a passion for uh, oncology research, in particular for pediatric oncology research. And I think he would love to see more students from our program uh, take off careers in that direction uh, in all different areas, whether it's drug discovery or whether it's clinical trial work or whether it's you know working in other areas. I think he really would love to see more of that. But again, it's not limited to that. I think that's just a, you know, his passion. And from that passion, really, he's you know, offering us the opportunity to try and get students interested in careers that are maybe a little different than what they originally thought of when they thought about coming to pharmacy school. Wow, what, what a neat gift. I mean, you must have been excited about this. You know, we really were excited. Um, he's a wonderful young guy, uh, and the work that he's been doing uh, uh, with the, the number of companies that he's worked with is, is really exciting. He's come to campus, he's interacted with our students, he's uh, helped to, uh, he spent time in the classroom, you know, uh, in, in prov providing education. He spent time with our students, helping to mentor them um, and, you know, give them uh, career advice. So it's really exciting now that he's put um, some philanthropic dollars behind that investment back in the college to really try and you know help the students who come to Ohio Northern to find careers that will be meaningful in the sciences. What a neat thing for Ohio Northern University. Thank you very much for sharing this great news with us today. Thank you, Holly. All right, don't go away. New Edition continues in a moment.